Hey, it says what? Thanks for stopping by my channel. I really appreciate it when you watch my videos, leave me a like or a comment, and subscribe to my channel. Before we get started, YouTube is still sending me live reactions of what people think of my videos, so let's get it out of the way. I'm like sick of you. Like honestly sick of you. Like you need to stop, okay? You'll like So I'm so tired of this, like, and everything is stupid. Like everything is stupid. Okay. And I'm not going to like go into individual, like, like style, like things I didn't like or whatever. So, um, there are a few things that are pretty much guaranteed to make me buy a bag. <laughs> well, that's not true because the first thing that I'm really liking, but I don't think I, I have a bag that meets this criteria. And that's um, when the hardware that attaches the strap to the bag, if it's a ring on a ring, um, kind of like um, the Dior lady bag, or maybe this bag from Coach, or this um, Daniel bag from Hammett. As I mentioned, I don't have <laughs> any of those bags, but I look at that bag from Hammett pretty frequently, both new and on the resale market. I really like that. Sticking with the way the strap is attached to the bag, you may or may not know the way Dooney and Burke attaches that leisure shopper strap with the leather on leather attachment. I really, I really like that. And yeah, we've talked about whip stitching <laughs> in the past. I'm fairly obsessed and you know, that will make me think about buying a bag more often than not. And the th third thing is if it's a drawstring, <laughs> but that's a story for another day. The fourth thing is woven leather. I am just so fascinated by it at the time I have a woven leather bag from Dooney and Burke uh, from the Tasuta line. Here's a photo of Dooney's Tasuta bags. And I also have a woven leather bag from Patricia Nash where the front of this saddle bag, the Acera, is woven. But why you're all here, <laughs> and sorry I made you wait, is my Kohan Genevieve tote. I think they made this in two sizes. There's a large Genevieve, and then um, I'm not sure what the official name of this one was called, but these are pretty widely available on the resale market. This one is stuffed, let me unstuff it. I decided to write down the measurements the last time I measured it so that I don't have to keep measuring every time. But this is 15 inches long at the bottom, but you can see it tapers up a lot to about 11 inches um, here in the usable space. I would say it's seven and a half high in the middle here and it goes up to nine and then it's five inches deep it does not have feet on the bottom but it has a solid leather bottom it's in this 
dark espresso brown color. And it has um, two shoulder straps that has about a nine inch drop. I wanted to come closer so you could see this beautiful woven detail up close. There's the Kohan logo there. There's nothing on this side. And then that's the bottom. The straps are sort of braided and woven at the same time. And can you hear that leather creaking? So I forget where I got this bag, but um, I have a dust bag somewhere. <laughs> This is the interior. It closes with this kind of dog leash closure. Like this in the center. It has this light lining and there's no organization on the front wall. Back wall has a zipper pocket and then two slip pockets. One of them has a snap on it try to give you a better look at that and then it has this little hook almost like a d-ring you could snap your keys on still has plastic on it even though this is a dark colored black bag I think the woven nature of the leather makes it easy to carry any time of year to be really summery, I used my hydrangea, Jenny and Burke pieces with it. So I have a small Carrington, a medium wristlet, a coin case, and a card case. Those all fit in there, no problem. And if you're familiar with the size of a coach notebook, I think they're about eight and a half by six inches. That will fit in there, kind of laying on its side. It fits in there standing up, but it sticks out a little bit. So let me snap it closed. And you can get an idea of what it looks like. It will fit over my arm, but it's really tight. So I like to carry it on the crook of my arm. I like to carry it on the crook of my arm. So that is a look at my Cole Haan Genevieve Tote or Hobo. Not exactly sure of the name. Do you like woven leather bags? What checks off all your boxes and makes you take the leap to buy a bag? Let me know. Thanks for watching everyone. Take care.